Hi guys, it's Aaliyah. Welcome back to my channel. Oops, I have my whole address sticking out right there. <laughs> That's okay. Um, I wanted to come on real quick to share an Etsy shop that I had recently purchased something from and it arrived today. I actually think a lot of you probably know this um, person is, well, her um, YouTube is Bonnie and Clive. And I haven't opened it yet, as you can see, so I'm going to open it with you guys. Now, I don't, sometimes I'm always afraid to open packages that I'd be too rough. But this can also be reused, this very, very beautiful pink eyelash trim. So that I have to keep aside there. And, oh, she packages it up so nicely. Oh gosh, I don't want to ruin it. Let's see if I can just cut it a little bit. There we go. And let's see. Sometimes I definitely feel like I'm way too rough for some of these packaging. And you know, maybe you don't have to keep it, but sometimes I like to keep the packaging it comes in to reuse it in, you know, another project or something, because why not? But I always have to be careful of not being too harsh. Oh, there we go. I think, oh, one little one left right here. Okie dokes. So let's get into this. Since I worked so hard taking this off, let me put that to the side nicely. It's like in a package in another package. This is so well wrapped. Oh my gosh. All right, so this is like a sleeve protector, it almost looks like. Um, there we go, and there we go. Okay, so I put that aside, and I see that there is a note, so let me just take that off. And... You are so welcome. Oh, thank you. I am delighted. First of all, what is this? <gasps> Look how beautiful this is. I don't know if you can see it. It has this like iridescent glow sort of, and maybe I'm not, those aren't the right words, but it looks so cool. I, I'm really hoping the camera's picking it up. See, like I'm talking about like all this inside here. Wow, this is just really, really cool. I don't know how it does that. Oops, hold on one second. My cat's trying to come in. Hello, come on. All right. Excuse me, excuse me. All right, so that is really nice. One of the things that, unfortunately, I think I might have to hoard because it's like one of a kind <laughs> and I don't want to use it in a regular journal, but you never know. But for now, it's all mine. <laughs> so thank you. And so what I ordered was these little candy bags. Um, a while back on her channel, she was doing this giveaway and it was a fun giveaway. She had like a whole tray full of these bags and you had to guess how many bags were there. And then the winner obviously would win, um, the bags. And I played <laughs> a lot because it was basically like she, she showed the video and then after in the comments, you'd have to comment, you know, what, how many you thought it was. And so people were going back and forth and back and forth and posting a number and another number, and another number. So it was, it really was a whole bunch of fun. And then I, I was meaning to go back to her shop and to order some and time passed and I completely forgot. Um, and then the other day I was thinking about, it. I was like, oh, I never got those bags. So I went to her shop. Luckily she still has them. And I purchased some. So this is here. She had sent also some that are plain. Uh, this is what they're supposed to look like. Not plain. Well, kind of plain. Um, and then she coffee dyed them. So this is kind of neat because I can have some of each. 
though I definitely love the look of the coffee die but the nice thing about these then you can alter them for however you want to alter them or you know if um, I want to Kool-Aid dye them I could do that or beet dye them avocado dye them so there's some other um, things that I can do with these as well unless I want to just use them plain but in my last journal that I just just made the um, Dear Diary one I used bags um, two bags in it and I really like the way they came out and see these are small enough that it would fit on a page I don't know if it would fit on a, a TN size. Actually, just barely. Hold on. Let's just see how wide these are. So they're a little under four. So I don't know. That is three and seven eighths, maybe. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, three and seven eighths. And I mean, obviously, the height doesn't matter, but the little edges are at five and a half. So this actually would definitely fit in all the sizes except for the little tiny sizes that I make in um, journals. So that is awesome. So I have a little stash here. So you'll definitely be seeing these because I wanted these for so long. So I'm so psyched that I got those. So I got that and then, um, again, I don't want to ruin this. I had a, um, a staple puller. Let me see if I can just... And they can just use my nails. Oh, and if you notice, I finally broke this nail. That was a painful thing to, to have. Oh, kiddokes. So, oops. There we go. And this actually, <laughs> I'd, I'd use this too. I can see some buttons on top of that. So I want to put this to the side because I will definitely use that. And then look at this bag. The bag that it even comes is so cool too. It looks like maybe you put ribs in it. Because see it says, uh, it's like full of flavor, made with love, taste sensations from the baker. Oh, maybe this is for um, bread. A loaf of bread, possibly. But it's really cool because it's like it has a little window here. See what I mean? So this, this would be cool to use in a journal. Huh. So I'll save that one. And so this is also what I purchased. These little itty bitties. How cute are these? Let's see if you can see them all. There we go. So they're basically all the same. They're like little crochet doilies, but what I want to do is make clusters with them for my journals. So probably not the smaller journals, like the TN size, the eight and a quarter by four and a quarter, but the larger ones that I've been doing um, that are, what are they like, eight and a half by five and a half, they'll look much better. I feel like if I use something like this on a traveler's notebook page, it will take up too much room. But then again, you know what? Hold on. I have a traveler's notebook that I'm working on right now. Let me just see. It actually wouldn't look that bad. Oh, so, okay, I take it back. These can be used in any of my journals. Well, I will be using them in any of my journals. So that is awesome. I am really, really happy with my purchase. I can't wait to use these. I was so excited about both of them. Um, and actually coming from Australia is really fast shipping. I thought, you know, a lot of times when you order things that are far away, you know, overseas, that it does take a lot longer. Um, but this, this wasn't, it, it wasn't that long that I remember. It just seemed like it was pretty quick. So um, if you are interested in checking out the cool items that she has in her shop. I'm going to leave her shop link below. And um, I'll also leave her YouTube channel below because she has tons and tons and tons of great videos. So definitely check her out. And um, Bonnie, if you're watching, thank you so much for all this goodness. Um, and thank you everybody else for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.